Hey guys, it's Christina. Um, I know I haven't made a video on here in a long time, but I haven't really been scrapbooking um, much. I am extremely busy with school and other things and just haven't had time. But lately I have been doing a little bit of scrapbooking. Um, several of my layouts have already, already been put in the, my scrapbook. But this one I just finished and I thought I would... Um, do a little video on it and post it since I haven't made a video in so long. Um, this is my nephew, my youngest nephew, um, and I did take inspiration from a Mercy Tierra video, um, Silly Sleepovers or Sleepover Silliness or something like that I think was the layout name. Um, I just liked all the layering she did, and normally when I would do a layout, I don't know if I can get you the whole there. Um, normally when I would do a layout, I would normally put this down in the corner and up. See how it's it's higher than normal, but so that was kind of a challenge for me. Um, but I will walk you through what I used and. Yeah. I did outline everything just because I like the way it pops off the page. Um, starting here, um, this is a piece of paper from um, Pink Paisley. Is it Pink Paisley? I don't know. Yeah, Pink Paisley Hometown Summer. It's this star paper right here. Um, and then this paper right here, and then I use some more up here, is from the Basic Gray PB&J collection, and it is that one. And then, basically up here, I used here's I used a little punch of some sassafras wood grain paper. Um, I used a lot of Amy Tangerine. And I can't ever call her Amy Tangerine because I know her as Amy Tan. Um, I actually know her. I used to scrapbook with her a couple years ago, several years ago. And I know her as Amy Tan. But her line is Amy Tangerine. So, anyway. <laughs> um, this is a die cut from her collection. This is a die cut. I'm not sure where that one came from. This is a die cut. Is that it? And then I use the rest of the die cut up here. Here's a die cut from her collection. Um, this is from the Studio Calico kit. I put some washi behind the love and then actually use the cutouts over here. Um, this is an October afternoon sticker. This is a little vellum envelope. This is a basic gray chipboard piece. I use some gray washi down here with some Studio Calico star wood veneers. This is an Amy Tan um, die cut. And then up here I have some more of that sassafras wood grain paper. This is an October afternoon flower sack piece from... I don't remember which collection. This is a Tim Holtz word sticker, um, another wood veneer, and that's basically it. Oh, my word, my letters are from, let me pull it out, they're from this Crepe Paper Pretty Party collection. I used, you can't really, they're like a white wood grain, I guess, and then I used those up there as well. And it says totes fresh because I don't know, someone there's a person in my life who not a person in my, that sounded weird. I have a friend, a person in my life. I have a friend who says stuff like that all the time. And at first I couldn't stand it. I was like, what are you saying that for? But now I catch myself saying it and anyway I thought it was kind of funny so I put it on there. Um so, I'll give you one more shot. 
<laughs> my dog is snoring. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, that's my layout, and thanks for watching, guys. Bye.